These are the horses for the fifth race. Number one, Noble Mamsell. Rebecca Dwyer, Jamestown. Joshua Green, Zeno. High Josh Green trains Rocky Stidham. Drives the one, Noble Mamsell. Number two, follow the money. Joyce and Richard McClellan, Zanesville, Ohio. Eric Nussel Road trains Dave Hawk. The two, follow the money. Number three, Nuclear Cam. Roland Rove, Columbus, Ohio. Virgil Morgan Jr. trains Mike LeChance. On the three, Nuclear Cam. Number four is Air Taylor. Clarence DeLong, Orient, Ohio. Daryl Hooser trains Don Irvine Jr. On the four, Air Taylor. Number five, Vicky's return. Jim Plummer, Walston, Ohio. John Plummer trains and drives the five, Vicky's return. Number six is Amicus Lee Lady. Gretchen Rosman of LaRue, Ohio. Richard Rosman trains. David Miller drives the six. Emma Classy Lass. Number seven is Casey Camaria. Kathleen Cooks, Ohio. Marty Willem trains. Scott Cox on the seven. Casey Camaria. And number eight, Grandma Gordy. Dean Davis of Worcester, Ohio. Kurt Sugg trains. John Campbell. In her sulky, number eight, Grandma Gordy. Win, play, show, perfecta, trifecta, Danny Double Wagering. Don't be shut out. They'll go to the post. In set. Stride out there pretty good. That was the B and Coney selection, follow the money. We are taking a look at there with Dave Hawk and that Black Jack Sulky. And uh, you're helping to make the favorites here today, too, currently at 9 to 5. Well... The Voice is back where he belongs, behind the microphone here at Delaware, Ohio. Let's send it up to our man, Roger Houston. Ohio Breeders' Championship, three-year-old pacing fillies. Moving in behind the Great Coon starting gate on the upper turn. The geek swings into the stretch and here they come. Pacing fast out of the gate between horses. Vicky's return to grab the lead. On the inside, Rocky's gentleman, Noble Mamsell. Racing third on the outside, Grandma Gordy. Going on. Now second and going right on to the front end for John Gamble. Nuclear Kim ducks to the pylons. Fourth, racing fifth. Air Taylor. Sixth on the inside. I'm a classy last. Hope. Betting quarter, 27 and 4. He out of the turn, go on to the 3 8 mark. Casey Camaria racing 7, treading the field on the outside. Follow the money as they race around the turn. Grandma Gordy on top by 2. Racing second, Vicky's return. Pacing third, Noble Mamsell. Fourth is Nuclear Kim. As they pass the turn of the first time. Moving up on the outside. Emma Classy last. Followed by Battle of the Money. Halfway home, 58 and 3. On to the back side. Grandma Gordy has the lead. Vicky's return and John Plummer. On the outside, second. Noble Mamsell racing third. Down the back side. Go on to the three-quarter mark. About to go three wide. Am a classy lass. Getting the jump, though. Follow the money. And Dave Hawk. Go on to the three-quarter mark. Three quarters. One, 27 and three. 29 seconds. Third quarter. A little more than eight to go. Grandma Gordy with the lead. Opens up. Noble Mamsell second. On the outside. Follow the money third. Less than an eight to go. Grandma Gordy and John Campbell drawing away with every stride. Making about 12 lengths. Grandma Gordy. Follow the money second. Emma Classy last. Third. One. 55 and three. John. Moving to the winner's circle. The winner of the fifth race. Ohio Breeders Championship. Three year old Philly Pace. Second division. First of $24,302. Number eight, Grandma Gordy. Dean Davis, Western Ohio, the owner. Kirk Sugg trains. John Campbell gets his fourth one of the week here at Delaware. 
Real Philip Towers, big guy at Amazing Sabra. Lifetime mark, 155 and 3. Final half, 57. Final quarter, 28. Seventh win in 20. And the winner now of four in a row in Ohio. And for driver John Campbell, the winningest driver of all time at the Delaware County Fair. Win number 108. So John Campbell and Bob Glazer again out in the winner's circle. Uh, as mentioned before, they hope to spend most of the afternoon there, especially after the Jug Elimin final. But uh, there are Kurt and Brenda Sugg, and there are, I believe, twins. Twins, yes. Kurt has twins. and uh, You know a little bit about that yourself. Know a little bit about twins. It's, uh, it's a great thing. And congratulations to Kurt and his wife, Brenda. And here's our prices for the fifth.